Hey guys, so Jane here from Laser Gaming. In this video, I want to talk about the Battlefield 1 beta. We actually got some pretty credible information on this earlier today, but before we get into this video, just like say, I know a lot of you are new here, and thank you. I've had a ton of great support lately on Battlefield 1, so thank you to my new subscribers and for my old subscribers for sticking around. And also, I know a lot of you, or some of you might be thinking this, whether you commented or not is your own option, but I know I say that I'm usually the first to get news out and stuff like that, and I saw that Iceman Oz posted a video about seven minutes ago of me filming this, and I basically didn't get this out first. I knew about this like eight hours ago, but I was out with my family all day, so I think that comes first, but anyway, trying to get this video out to you about the Battlefield 1 beta, so please forgive me because I didn't get, I wasn't the first person to get this one out on YouTube. But anyway, so earlier today, a German community manager for Battlefield 1 was streaming on Twitch and it wasn't a Q&A stream but when developers usually get onto Twitch or any streaming thing people tend to spam them a lot of questions and somebody was asking him about the Battlefield 1 beta and he actually revealed that it'll be coming shortly after Gamescom. So for those of you who don't know Gamescom is between August 17th and 21st so hopefully this means we'll get a beta in late August or very early September Obviously, he could be trolling, and by saying soon, he could mean like a month after. But I'd bet on late August that would be a really good time for the beta because it's the end of summer for a lot of people. And in addition to this, I want to talk about what we might see in the Battlefield 1 beta. So, Battlefield Hardline's beta had three maps and three game modes, I believe. So, of course, we already have the first map, San Quentin St Scar, and we have two game modes, Conquest and Domination. Now, if they were to put a third game mode into the beta um, in addition to the two they already have in the alpha I bet on that they would put one of the new game modes that are coming to the game because it's something that Battlefield 1 could show off and sort of obviously it's a World War 1 game so it's already unique in that sense but it's something even more unique that they could show off to their audience and Battlefield Hardline used Hotwire mode as their new game mode which was really cool and Heist but Heist is similar to Rush in my opinion so we already have St. Quentin Scar, which has the Zeppelin uh, behemoth vehicle, and I would bet that we get another map that maybe is ocean-based or water-based, where we could see the battleship, which I'm just so hyped for. Naval Warfare is one of my favorite things in Battlefield 4, and that's what made uh, the Naval Strike DLC one of my favorite ones, and Carrier Assault is actually my favorite mode in the entire game. It's kind of a pity that there aren't too many populated servers anymore, but that video it's for a different day or a different time. But, and the last one is obviously the armored train. So I'm assuming we might see a desert map because that would sort of give a big variety. We have the Saint Quentin Scar, which seems like it's based in France. We'd have the ocean map, which might also be based in France. And then we also have a desert map. So if we had all those three, that'd be really awesome. Um, maybe we might get an infantry map because um, I know there's a mansion map. And I'm assuming that's going to be the block, the metro, the locker equivalent of this game. There's a map that's based in a building. And that that will be pretty awesome with the infantry combat on that map. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, don't forget to drop a like down below. Tell me what you guys want to see from my Battlefield 1 videos in the future. Once I get back home to my normal setup, I'm thinking about streaming the game, doing a little bit of Q&A. And me and Dangerous Moose are talking about doing a bit of a collaboration, talking about what we're looking forward to this game and what needs to change from the Battlefield 1 Alpha once the closed Alpha is actually ends. But again, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe if you are new here. That's what it is for today, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.